Here's the story of Ben Simmons and why Sixers fans hate Ben Simmons. Ben was drafted in 2016 with the first overall pick. He was highly touted as a generational type prospect who can completely flip around the 76ers, a team that had tanked the last couple years because they were terrible. One season, they even won 10 games. Ben Simmons had a LeBron type athletic ability, excellent passer, great defender. His one flaw was that he didn't have a jump shot. He's in the summer league after he first got drafted. He's taken all these jumpers. It looks okay. It doesn't look like a great jumper by any means, but he's taking mid-range jump shots. A few months later, he rolls his ankle in practice and he's out for the year. He didn't have his whole 2016 rookie season. Fast forward to 2017. It's his first season in the NBA. He looks really solid. He wins the rookie of the year. No jump shot yet, but there's a lot of signs that he's going to be a great player. Two more years go by. Barely any improvement from Ben Simmons. He's a tremendous defender and a very good passer, but never worked on his jump shot. And as a point guard, that's one of the most important things you need. But he was still very aggressive, and Philly fans had his back every step of the way. He got bashed by national media all the time because he didn't take jump shots and didn't try to take jump shots. Philly fans encouraged him, said he didn't need a jump shot. But in reality, when it came to playoff time, he really did need a jump shot. The way they defended him, they made it look like it was four on five out there. He wanted to be the primary ball handler so bad that they wound up letting go of Jimmy Butler and letting him go in a trade. This severely hurt the Sixers. But it was fine because we still thought that Ben Simmons could be a generational talent. He still didn't take jump shots. Fast forward to 2021. In the playoffs, multiple games in the series, he had either one shot in the fourth quarter or none. He is a star point guard who didn't try to score culminating in a Game 7 loss where he passed up a wide-open dunk to pass to a contested layup. This ultimately lost in the series where the 76ers were a one seed and they lost to a five-seed Atlanta Hawks team. To us Sixers fans, it looked like Ben Simmons gave up on us. He stopped being aggressive. And that's all we ask for you in Philadelphia is that you're aggressive and you hustle your hardest. Philly will have your back no matter what. Then Ben Simmons chickens out and says he doesn't want to play for the Sixers anymore. Asks for a trade, shows up to practice, doesn't try at all, then gets thrown out of practice. It's a whole messy situation. He then said he can't play because he has mental health issues, but didn't want to see a team doctor. And as soon as he got traded to the Nets, he's all of a sudden mentally ready to play. This is why Philadelphia hates Ben Simmons, and always will. We had his back for forever, and he never had ours. I agree with this 100%.